Hello, welcome everybody. Welcome. I am Mark McLean, Sparky Mark. How are you guys doing on this fine Sunday? Let me know how you're going in the chat. Um, I can see some uh, some familiar names in the participant list. So welcome everybody and also welcome to everybody who is new as well. So please, hi Toma, how are you? Um, and uh, Patrick Deman hi, says, hi Mark, uh, hi there. Um, now fantastic, please um, let me know for if for any reason you are using a parent Zoom or you have a, a different name uh, logged in to where, where you are, please let, let us know in the chat and say change my name too. And I can already see um, a few people are, uh, are doing that too. Um, okay, let me just double check. Also, I'm just double checking my microphone as well. Um, here we go. There we go. Let me let me just make sure that my microphone is working. Ah, it's very also very very loud. Sorry about that, guys. Obviously, just the beginning of these sessions. Um, one of the benefits of doing these live sessions are that you guys can ask me questions and we can discuss science and we can go a little bit deeper into science. But also, one of the um, uh, one of the other things is with these live shows is that we, uh, you know, have technical little things. So uh, hopefully my voice should be nice and clear now. I think it was just the volume was a bit loud. There we go. Now, let me know. Um, right. I can see a few people have asked to change their names. Fantastic. And uh, Patrick, I think you will be happy. Yes, absolutely. Um, yes, Tomo, I remember that you were the one that drew Auli. Uh, he's very, very happy. And uh, and in your in Puerto Rico. Um, now I can see uh, Ebne and George and Liam and Margaret and Massa and Raina and Tomo there and, and everyone else as well. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, and I think you guys will be happy. Don't worry. I can see lots of people making requests for a certain individual. Now, before we get going, um, just very quickly, we are going to be doing the Mel physics kit for the uh, rheoscopic fluid. And I'll explain what this is. Uh, what's going on. And if some of you have the set, please let me know in the set. No, we, um, uh, yeah, let me know in the, in the chat whether you're going to be doing the set with me or not. Um, and I know some of you guys just enjoy watching too. And don't worry, I have my extra camera here so you can kind of see everything that's going on. I'll be doing an unboxing of the set for anyone who's interested in what's in the set. And also, um, one of the questions that came through from Ebne is, can you see me? No, um, your cameras are not on, but you can see me and uh, my buddy, who I'm going to introduce in just a second. But um, but yeah, we can't see you. But that's why I rely on you to type into the chat or you can get a parent or um, adult as well to type into the chat as well. I love having your comments, your questions, and we'll do some polls as well to kind of keep it interesting. Fantastic. Um, now I can see Rena said yours has not arrived yet, but you'll be watching. Fantastic. Welcome to this session. Fantastic. Now, great. Um, before we get going, there are two very important individuals I have to introduce you to. The first is Miss Kay. It's <laughs> fantastic. Brilliant. Now we have Kelsey in the chat. So that's K-E-L. Yeah, Kelsey. Fantastic. Good. I can see. Fantastic. We've got Kelsey. And if you could say hello to Kelsey, K-E-L-S-E-Y. There we go. She's saying hi to everybody. Now she's in the chat. So if you have any questions or you have any proper problems with your audio or video, please do let her know. Um, and uh, she's very helpful. We're very, very fortunate to have her. So thank you very much, Kelsey. Perfect. Um, and uh, exactly. Fantastic. Brilliant. How, what a welcoming bunch you are to Kelsey. Now, that, uh, I, now I said there were two important individuals. The second um, is this chap here. Yes, I can see many of you guys. Now, um, this is Auli. Hey, what's, what's up, buddy? What's occurring? Nothing much. You excited about today's session? Yes. Now, Ali is super excited about this one. I'm too, because I love, love this set. I have to say, the guys that develop these must have so much fun. Uh, why are you so excited about it? Yes, the pretty colours, and we're going to get to make our own... <gasps> Actually, I'm not going to spoil it. We're going to do some pretty cool stuff, but there's definitely a lot of cool colours, aren't there, today? Yes, fantastic. And uh, now, um, I know that some of you guys knew, know who Ali is. For those of you who have not met Ali before, he is... Oh, yeah. No, I wasn't going to. Don't worry. I wasn't going to say it, Auli. Definitely was not going to say that he's a toy stuffed owl. Because he's definitely not. He's 
Owly thinks he's a real owl, so he doesn't like being called a toy at all. So yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, definitely a real owl. Okay, no, I know my voice sounds like I'm being sarcastic and you're not really an owl and I'm saying he's really an owl. No, no, you're definitely, definitely a real owl that lives in a house with a human being doing science experiments because that's definitely what owls do, isn't it? Yeah, cool. Anyway, so this is Owly. I use him on some of the early um, male science demonstrations and you guys, it turns out, absolutely love him. And I think if I did a session without him, uh, he's definitely more popular than I am. So there we go. So anyway, thanks very much for, for being here, Owly. Um, are you going to help me with some of the experiments? Yes. Awesome. Thanks, buddy. OK. Um, yes. And actually, um, I know that you guys do love Owly. Um, in fact, Tomo, who's one of the people in the in the chat, um, actually drew a fantastic owl and emailed it to us. So if you guys, uh, you love him too. Not sarcastic. Fantastic. All right. Brilliant. Yeah. So if anyone else wants to draw pictures of Owlies, I, I'm, I'm not sure how scientific that is. You can also do any other scientific diagrams too. Please do email them uh, to us at uh, melacademy at melscience.com, please. Um, now, you, do you toggle chat? Yes, absolutely, Ebony. You can type into the chat and I'm happy to read out your questions as well. All right, Ali, you're going to come back for the science? Perfect. Brilliant. So as I said, with these sessions, I'm going to be building the set with you. I know some of you guys just like to watch. Some of you want to build it with. I'm also doing an un, uh, un, sort of unboxing so you can see everything. And also, um, if you have any questions, please, please feel free to ask them. And we will, um, and I'll read them out and, and do my best to answer them. Now, obviously, um, it'd be sort of better if we kept the questions related to physics and friction and the different types of flows that we're doing. But to be honest with you, those of you guys who know my sessions, I love asking, answering all the questions. So please, if you've got any questions, I'm happy to, to answer those too. And there is a little Q&A as well um, in Zoom that you can ask them into. And if I miss any, Kelsey will uh, remind me. Um, at the end. Fantastic. Yeah. And if you're on social media or your parents' social media, if you take pictures of this or any videos or anything like that, please do put the hashtag um, Mel Science as well. And Auli and I love going through those. In fact, that's what we do on a Sunday night. We, we sit down and we look through all the social media. And I think there's millions and millions of followers, you guys, actually millions and millions, um, which is incredible. Um, and you post such wonderful stuff. So we get to see that um, too. Fantastic. Uh, is Auli rolling his eyes? Yeah, sometimes Auli does roll his eyes at me, especially at me. Anyway. All right, let's get going. So we're going to unbox this set and then I'll get into the kind of science behind all of this. OK, so essentially what we're going to be looking at is we're going to be exploring today the complexity of fluid movement. OK, now, what do we mean by fluids? Fluids are, um, are substances that can move very easily. For example, the air around us is a type of fluid. And so is also liquids like water, tea, syrup, honey, lots of other stuff too. OK, fantastic. Yeah, milk, absolutely, would be a fluid too. Anything essentially that can move and that. But a lot of people think of it as just being liquids, but actually it can also be air as well. So let me just quickly ask you guys a question. OK, now we've um, have you ever seen. But think about it. These buildings are so enormous. OK, they're absolutely enormous. They're you know, sort of 40, 50, 60, 70 floors tall. What? How do we get air into there? 
They don't just have open windows, they have air conditioning systems to keep the regular temperature. But not only that, this is where it gets a little bit gross and now Auli's definitely rolling his eyes because he knows what happens when they flush the lavatories, when they flush the toilets. Okay, what happens? Where, where does that water go? Well, they have to obviously get rid of that. And we also need to pump water up to the top. So I have to say these buildings are incredibly expensive to build, not just because of the building materials, but also the plumbing, the electricity and everything like that. Now we're gonna be talking about fluids today and the fluids are the liquids like water and also the air. And by the way, in order to plan those systems, and in fact, that's actually what my cousin does, it plans those systems. We have to understand something called fluid dynamics. Okay, and that's just a sort of a, a very fancy way of saying how fluids, so gases and liquids, move through the building. So water and air and that kind of stuff. Okay, fantastic. Um, now, well done, Master said, um, does it fly out of the side of a pipe at the side of the building? So when they flush the toilet, there's just the pipe just pours out. That would be gross. I know, I know. I get that you were just joking, but yeah, yeah, I know you know that doesn't happen, but that's a that's a very good one. All right, fantastic. Yes, absolutely right. And I can see that Cashin had said to the sewer, and that's absolutely right. So when they, we flush the, the lavatories or the toilets, what happens is that, that has to go somewhere. And by the way, think about it. People, when they arrive at the, the, uh, at the building at the same time, especially with the buildings where there are many, many people living at the same time, very often, lots of those people will wake up a roughly the same kind of day. What happens if everyone flushes a lavatory or a toilet at the same time? Ah! So, in fact, they have to be very careful with these buildings to make sure the pipes are thick enough. Now, we're going to go into why this is important. And I say we're going to be looking at different kind of flows. OK, so we looked at it. Now, we're going to be talking about turbulence. OK, right. But as we say, let's get the set going so you can kind of see what's going on. And uh, let's have a look here. So. Um, now, I'm not sure what's going on with the focus. Let's see. Come on. Are you going to focus camera? There we go. Uh, sorry, I'm not sure what is going on with the focus on this camera here. Um, as I say, I'm just using a new system now. So I'm just trying to make sure that I get used to this. Hello. Hello. What's going on here? Table character. Let's see. I wonder if... Um, oh, dear. That's not so good. Uh, here we go. Right. So let me, it seems to be focusing really, really close up. So uh, what I'll do is I'll just bring this a little bit closer here and then we can kind of see what's going on here, guys. Sorry about this little technical um, hitch, but I tell you what, if, if it continues, I will, we will, uh, there we go. Let's have a look at this. Right. Um, there we go. Now, as I say, one of the wonderful things about these live sessions are, you know, that you get to ask me questions live, but sometimes we have little technical difficulties. But uh, now what I'm going to be doing is opening up the rheoscopic fluid set for you. OK, and then we will get going right now. So what I might do is I also have another camera. So what I can do is I can try and use that if there is any problem. But let's see how we go now. So tabletop. Um, yep. OK, well, I'm going to just pull this a little bit closer and we'll get going. So what we're going to be doing is the first one here is the turbulence one. OK, we're going to be looking at rheoscopic fluid. We're going to be looking at turbulence here. OK. All right. Fantastic. So, um, yeah, as I said, I'm not sure why this is uh, not focusing, guys. I'm very sorry about that. Um, yeah, sorry, it's blurry. Um, I tell you what we what I might have to do is I might have to switch to Ecamm. Um, but here we go. Sorry, guys. I'm just going to make sure that. Uh, yeah, I'm very sorry about that. OK. All right. Well, um, yeah, I'm not sure why it is doing this now. Um, OK, let me have a quick look. Uh, I'm very sorry, as I say, with these live things, you know, it is, uh, it's obviously wonderful that we can do this technology, but um, there we go. All right, so uh, let me, let me have a, I'll have a look at that in just a second and uh, see whether there's a, a way we can, uh, we can, um, maybe if Kelsey, if you could have a look and see, I'm not sure if there's any of the guys in the, the office who can check. But anyway, let's see. What I'm going to do anyway, let's get going. So the first thing I'm going to do is we're going to be opening up the um, the turbulence set. OK. And so within there. Um, yes. Now, one of the questions Master said, when everybody flushes the toilet at the same time, it all flies out the sky and falls on someone's head. 
I think that'd be pretty gross. Luckily, we now have a sewer system that stops the, the drains that stop that from happening. I, I got that you were making a joke. Don't worry, that's absolutely fine. All right, um, what, let me just, as I say, what I'm going to do then is um, I have, there we go. Let me, give me one second. I'm just gonna restart the camera. Give me one second. There we go. Now, 